Welcome to today's positive thought for August the 6th. Uh, if you've watched the Angel or Archangel of the Day video, you'll know it was regarding uh, the Archangel of Leo, which is Shavartiel. So the positive thought, actually, what we're going to do is very much look at the, the attributes of uh, the lion and uh, looking at what uh, aspects uh, the lion symbolises and how we can sort of uh, bring those skills into uh, very much our own lives. So uh, uh, as maybe if you watched the, the previous angel video, uh, the lion very much is uh, the leader in uh, the African plain. Due, due to the nature, uh, it's nature that it is the top predator and in effect, all the other animals are scared of the lion because they know that the lion can kill it and obviously eat it. So from the point of view that the lion is often symbolised as a leader and clearly to attack other animals, then it needs to be strong. It needs to have strength. And uh, sometimes you might have seen lions where they might be uh, surrounded by hyenas. Uh, and maybe the lion is trying to protect a kill. It's just uh, killed an animal. And the hyenas uh, generally work in a group and look to, in effect, bully the lion away from the kills that they can have the food. Uh, being bullies that they like uh, the easy life. So they will like the lion to, to maybe kill an animal. And then the hyenas will uh, try to bully uh, the lion away. Uh, due to the, the nature of their pack, that there's more of them. And sometimes the lion has to stand its ground uh, if it feels that it can win against maybe three, four, five uh, hyenas. It will stand its ground uh, to make sure that it gets the food it's just killed. So uh, clearly in that example, the lion is outnumbered, but the lion will still stand its ground because uh, it has, you know, its courage, uh, it has its strength. In a one-to-one -one with uh, a battle with the hyena, the lion will always win. But when they are so maybe five to one or six to one, it becomes more difficult. So, uh, so some of the key things we need to, to consider in our own private life is uh, maybe becoming a, a strong person not a person who goes through life thinking, shall I do this? Shall I do that? I don't know. Maybe becoming, uh, maybe a bit of apathy creeping in. Uh, maybe uh, need a little bit more focus about what you want. If you ever watch uh, lions actually on a wildlife programme, they seem to uh, sleep a lot during the day. And then when they need to go to hunt, they uh, it's almost like a mind switch. They go into hunting mode and all of a sudden their uh, focus is on uh, catching an animal uh, for its food that they very much become very focused. And uh, maybe at times, uh, if you look at your own life, that you feel you're just plodding along, uh, maybe you're in a bit of a rut. You need to switch over to that mindset like a lion and think, right, sit down. What do I need to do to get out of this rut? What do I need to do to focus myself? What do I want in life? Uh, and start striving towards that goal or those goals. So it is important that we have leadership of our own lives. As I, I see many people who just plod along through life. Uh, they seem to have no drive, no conviction. Uh, if you ask them what they want in life, uh, if you ever talk to them because they're a bit uh, bored with life. And I often say, uh, OK, if you have a blank piece of paper, what would you want to do with your life? And they often say, well, I don't know. And so clearly you can see that there's no focus in the person. And if you don't know what you want in life, then how is the universe supposed to help you get it? So that is why uh, it is important to be a leader of your own life. Um, focus uh, for what you want. 
and be determined to succeed and reach a goal that you set yourself. Now, sometimes to reach that goal, you have to make strong decisions or big decisions. An example could be you're in uh, employment, you're working for a company, uh, but you've always wanted maybe to do <coughs> uh, landscape painting and that's your real focus and in your spare time, uh, any spare time you have, you want to uh, go out to the beach or you want to go to uh, the countryside and paint what you see. So uh, if you ask that person what they really want to do, they would probably say they want to do landscape painting or paintings of you know scenery or you know different landscapes so uh, with that person there you could say in the wrong job but to give up employment and to start to change to a completely different job will take a lot of strength and courage because uh, unless you've got loads of savings and lots of uh, money coming in then uh, stopping employment and taking a giant leap to self-employment uh, can be a very difficult decision and a very, very scary decision for anybody to make. Uh, you have to be very strong in your convictions and you have to understand whether you will have sufficient skills to do uh, the future work that you want. If you believe you have the skills, then it will take a lot of courage to make that sudden change. However, if it is a, a role you want to do and you are determined and the universe can see that you are determined, then the universe will help you make that decision come true and you will have the determination and certainly the ambition to make it succeed. In effect, you will become your own boss you will be the leader of your business, even though you are the only person there. But you still need the drive and determination to make it succeed. Uh, if you are self-employed and in the ex this example, being a uh, landscape artist, then you need to uh, be sort of like doing regular work. You need regular work to sell which will build up your clientele and followers. And then maybe the more work you do, the more buyers you have. And uh, if you have more buyers, then clearly you can ask for more money for your work as it becomes more popular and more in demand. And maybe from any work that you do, you can sell prints, which bring in more regular work. So as you can see, uh, to be a lion and to be a leader, you need to be determined. You need to take ownership of your own life. You need to be focused and you need to have the strength to stand by your convictions if you need to make any difficult decisions. So uh, if you do need to make difficult decisions, then uh, you do need strength and maybe look at uh, speaking to others who have made a similar decision as uh, the angels will often hide messages in other people's words and uh, a friend or a colleague who has been through something similar or somebody who is a good listener may be uh, able to offer advice on things to consider both good and bad in any uh, decision making. So there's, there's quite a lot uh, to consider and that is why there is an archangel over uh, this important decision making and uh, to be strong and determined and ambitious like we've seen with the archangel and the symbol of the lion then uh, it is a difficult uh, thing to do very difficult skills to have but once you uh, learn those skills and use them in your life on a daily or regular basis then you will see that your life changes for the better and it will be a significant jump and once you have these skills then you can help others to uh, promote their own strength their own determination and that is what good leaders are all about uh, being good listeners 
uh, been focused and been able to, uh, I suppose, in a way, bring out the best in others. So um, if you do have any difficult decisions to make, then maybe think about the skill sets and even the Archangel who rules uh, on this day and uh, actually think about uh, all the different uh, points, good and bad, and you'll be able to focus your mind and make the right decision. So uh, hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, then please uh, give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you're maybe not so keen on it, then even maybe thumbs down. As I do regular videos, then please, if you hit the subscribe button and the bell, you'll be notified when the next uh, video goes live. And as I said, there will be at least two a day. So you'll be notified when the next video goes live. And hopefully uh, it can uh, help you develop as an individual and be a happier person in uh, the modern world that we live.